Oh boy, oh boy. It's finally fucking Friday, fam. How's it going, y'all? So I got a hard here coming at you guys with another early morning on my way to work vlog. And I don't really got much early want to talk to you guys about today. I'm just it's raining. <laughs> that fucking sucks. That's right through this fucking rain. But uh I'm basically just checking in and give y'all a quick update how my new year is going so far. fucking year. I made a New Year's resolution as well this year. Uh, fuck that red light. But anyways, <laughs> I'm, I made it where it's pretty much impossible for me to not stick to my New Year's resolution. Okay? Like most people, my New Year's resolution is to get in shape, you know? I want to get back to how I was in high school, or rather I just want to trim down most of the body fat I got. So what I'm doing is every day, Monday through Friday, I'm hitting the gym. Like, as soon as I get off work, I go straight to the gym. I don't even go home because if I go home, excuse me, that's going to give me the chance to sit down and give me the chance to get lazy and then be like, uh, I'll do it later, I'll do it tomorrow, uh, all that shit. I, no, so I want to avoid all that. So as soon as I get off work, I take my ass directly to the gym. Don't go by my house or anything like that. And another thing I'm doing to uh, stick with my New Year's resolution, I'm also eating healthier, you know? A lot of people, they go to the gym, or at least they'll start going to the gym, start exercising and shit, and then they're still eating the same way, like pizza, donuts, cheeseburgers, uh, all this high, high fat shit. And then they be looking at themselves like, why am I not losing any weight? Or how come I'm not, how come I'm not noticing any difference? I've been exercising, but a lot of people fail to realize. I'm sorry if I keep pausing this sec. I think I'm a little sick. So, get having a little, a little bit of mucus and stuff. Like I was saying, what a lot of people think is just because you go to the gym, that gives you the room to eat whatever the fuck you want and not have to worry about it. But no, it don't work like that, son. You can, you put on calories a lot easy, easier eating them than you do working out to burn them off. Like, you may spend a whole hour in the gym and only burn like what? A thousand calories? Which as we all know, a thousand calories, that's not even a pound, dude. You need to burn, what is it? I think it's every 2,300 calories equals one pound or something like that. Uh, I'm not sure, I'll put up on the screen here. That's how many calories equal one pound. But yeah, man, that's the problem a lot of people got. Then they 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 get discouraged, you know. They don't see any results, so they start saying to themselves, "What's for me going to the gym if I'm not only not losing weight but actually putting on weight?" So they start going. But like I said, fam, you, you can't just exercise and expect to lose a lot of weight really quickly. You got to eat right as well. So this is how I'm eating right every day. When I get up, in the, well, yeah, before I go to work. See, I told you guys already, I'm on the Herbalife stuff now, right? I went ahead and I bought my mixtures and everything, so now I got stuff at home where I don't gotta stop in the store and buy it for anybody to wait to pick it up or anything like that. So here's what I do. The night before I go to bed, I take my shake, put it in the blender, I make my shake, right? Then when I get up in the morning, I make my hot tea as well. I have me a thermos. So in the thermos, I pour my, tea, my hot tea in to keep it hot until I get to work. So for breakfast, I have my tea and then I have my shake that I prepared the night before, right? That's Herbalife. It's a uh, vegetarian, it's very nutritious for you. It has protein and stuff in it. Here's this fucking rain again. Fuck. And ah, shit. The rain is actually picked up. Just fucking wonderful. Hopefully my camera and battery can hold up. There's most of the one I'm sitting still that I'm worried about. But anywho, uh, carbon side, which I can't even change lanes. 
You know what I'm saying, man? Yeah, this stuff very fucking nutritious. Very, very good for you. So I take that. That's my breakfast. And then throughout the day, like instead of me uh, stopping at McDonald's, Burger King, or anything like that, I'm uh, snacking on a bunch of fruit throughout the day, right? Fruit and crackers and stuff. So I don't eat any meat until, <coughs> excuse me, until around seven or eight o'clock at night. I don't eat any meat at all. It's hard as fuck, man. There, I have so many fucking cravings, man. Every time I pass by Wendy's, KFC, Burger King, uh, McDonald's, or any fucking thing, I be like, fuck, I wanna go in and just grab me a fucking burger right now, man. So I resist that urge. You gotta have the mental capacity to resist that fucking urge, man. So, so far, today is Friday, the, um, uh, what the fuck is it? Uh, Monday was the knife. So, whatever Friday is. Oh, uh, uh, okay, yes. <laughs> Holy shit, today Friday the 13th. <laughs> yeah, yeah. This is how I was thinking about New Year's resolution. So, like I said, I'm going to the gym as soon as I get off work. I don't make any detours, don't stop by the house or nothing. I just go shoot my ass straight up to the gym. And then when I leave the gym, I go home, get cleaned up, edit a video if I have to, and then I cook. But until seven or eight, I don't actually eat. Or I mean, that's that's usually around the time the food is ready, anyways, you know. But prior to that, throughout the day when I go to work, I have two Herbalife shakes because I uh, bring the powdered mixture and the Ziploc bag as well. So I have also also have Herbalife shake, a Herbalife shake for uh, lunch and stuff as well, along with an uh, apple, orange, pear, grapes, or whatever. Just one fruit. And that's my lunch for a day. And until I get home from the gym and done cooking dinner, like I said, I don't touch any meat. All right. So that's my New Year's resolution, fam, to get healthy, get back in shape, and everything. And that's my the methods I'm going through to keep my New Year's resolutions. But hey, I tell you what, man. Comment section down below. Why don't you guys let me know what your New Year's resolutions are? And uh, also, let me know how you intend to keep it. How you intend to stick to it? I mean, I know a lot of people say. It's, Say something easy like uh get more money <laughs> get a better job I mean, those things are easy but at the same time they can be difficult as well depending on uh, what your background is so hey a lot of people might look at it like man that's a sorry ass excuse for a new year's resolution but no it's not dude get more money get a better job when you get more money you have a better job you can do more you can get more out of life me i just got promoted to a better fucking job I absolutely love my new fucking job, man. Fuck that shit. I get to I drive around by myself. I make up my own motherfucking schedule. I don't got to worry about nobody checking in on me or following me, making sure I'm doing this, doing that, making sure I'm not over here doing something. Not fuck that shit, son. I have complete, total control over my fucking schedule. Just me, myself, and I. <laughs> oh, shit. Anyways, fam, if y'all enjoyed the video, go ahead and leave me a like uh, down below. Of course, subscribe to my channel if you're not already one of my beautiful subscribers. But in the meantime, fam, this is me, your boy, Psychotic Heart. And as for the usual, peace out, motherfuckers!